Hi there guys, how are we doing? Phil Kent here with some more um, free tools, tips and training as part of my internet marketing training course. Now, in a previous video I spoke about um, a site called Ad Creator, where you can create um, simple images and you can make them stand out in places like Craigslist or Backpage or anywhere like that. Now what I did mention was that when you go through to the advert you can then click on that image to make it click, it becomes a clickable image to take you straight through to your your web page or your sales page or wherever you want people to go. Now, obviously, when you've just made that image and it's plain, it's not clickable. So you need to make it clickable. And to do that, I use this site over here. And there, there's a few. You just need a, a free image hosting site, and there's there's plenty of them around. Um, I used to use Photo Bucket for quite some time, but I found it a little bit temperamental lately where it doesn't always load the pages, doesn't display things um, every single time. It's just become a little bit temperamental for some reason. I don't know if it was just my site, but I found it to be a little bit unreliable, for, certainly for what it used to be. So I now use this one called Tiny Pick. Um, it's tinypick.com. Um, very, again, free account, very, very easy to use, and very straightforward. Very, you know, very sort of newbie friendly or user friendly should I say and all you would do so say you've just created um, one of those images that I showed you using ad creator you then come over here and you click on your upload which brings you to this part here and you can, see, you can choose the file you, you'd click that you then find the location on your uh, PC or laptop wherever you saved it to and just click the upload button here it really is straightforward guys and then it will upload it and then once it's, once it's up there, if I click on sort of your stuff, you'll see some of the templates I've made previously. Um, so let's show you. You can see these images that I've brought up that are made clickable. Um, so if I find the example that I used before, I'll just use any of them. So let's just, let's just click on one of them that I made before, for one of my programs. Yeah, so this is one I was making. This is quite a... Uh, Generic sort of picture, as you can see. Once again, it was edited fully inside Ad Creator. Um, so this is if if it was inside Craigslist or if it was inside um, Backpage or something like that. They've, they've clicked on the title, the headline, and when they open up the ad, this is what they see. So they read that and they think they might think, oh, this sounds sounds interesting, and they can actually click on the image to take them through the sales page. Now, how you do that is so simple, because as you can hear <coughs> here. Um, as you can see, you've got HTML for websites here. Yeah, see this here? So what you would do, you would just click on that, and as you can see, it highlights the whole lot. You right-click and then copy that. If I then bring up a... Um, let's get a new one. We don't need all that. Let's just go get a new notepad, and I'll show you. Okay. You know, paste that into there. Now, as you can see at the moment, if this doesn't make much sense to you, it's, it's pretty pretty straightforward. All you're going to need to do is copy all this text into your back page or your Craigslist ad. And the only bit you'd need to um, change is, is the right at the beginning here, which is this address here in between the inverted commas. You would just need to change that to whichever site you were sending it to. Um, so if I was going to send it to one of mine, you know, or one of your site, you only need just this bit here because obviously you're still going to need the HTTP um, two dots and the four slashes to here. If you take that all that off and you remove that, if I was going to send it to one of my one of my sites, you know, I would just do that bit. And so you change that to that. So as you can see, you change the first address in between the commas there. Target is blank, which means it'll open up in a new window. And the rest is just, well, as you can see, it says the image source, and that's your uploaded, uploaded URL for the picture you just created. So once that was inside Backpage or Craigslist, they land on this. Once they click on that ad using that name you've just changed, um, it would go straight away to the, the first address that you'd put in at the front, which I just did. Okay, so if you're promoting a program and the offer that's where you need your referral link or your affiliate link, so you paste that into there, um, and then paste this whole, whole excuse me, <laughs> paste this whole code into the body of Craigslist or 
back page. All right. Um, I could probably I could probably show you actually one one sec. Let's make it a little bit easier for you. Let's get um. Actually, if I change browsers for you, go to let's just go new tab up. I'll click on some bookmarks here. I'll go into. I'll show you exactly how it works. Some of this I'm getting into is a bit more advanced, guys, so I won't be able to show you too much. Let me just bring this over so you can see what I'm doing. So here we are inside back page. Okay. Now, if I get up, I'm using a form fill here, so it's getting a bit sort of complicated, <laughs> um, a bit more advanced. But what I want to show you here, if, if, you, if you look over here, guys, you can see that at the top here, um, that text there, Okay, this is this is a, a stack counter. I won't get into that, but basically this doesn't show up on the ad. But I can show I can get rid of that completely. So as you can see here, all I've got now, okay, is the same text as I've got there, and I'll prove it to you. And I'll copy that over. I'll put that into here, okay. Into here. So this is a you know back page. Let's just say this simple three-step system generates huge daily income. I've just pasted that code into there like I just showed you. Then you put the rest of the information in. You scroll down and click the continue button if you're going to if you're going to be placing this. Um, and yeah, this is a back page bug at the moment. You have to keep doing this. You place it again. Let's continue. So you know as you can see, there we go. There's the there's the ad that I just uploaded. Now, can you see the difference now, guys? Yeah, so it probably makes it a bit more clearer to see. But there's your headline that was initially in the back page listing. They click on the ad, and this is what they see. You know, they see a nice big, clear, professionally sort of looking done ad. It stands out. You know, and if they were to click on that, it takes them straight to the, the address that I put in, which is at the moment going to that catch page. As you can see, so that, that's basically how it all works, um, which, is, which is much, you know, is, um, looks better, easy to do, and easy to follow. So that is using um, tinypick.com. So I hope that makes sense. You can check out my ad creator video under the internet marketing training course. You'll see how I made, uh, how I use these templates in it, and how you save them again using a free account. Save it to your PC, come over here onto Tiny Pick, upload it there. You can use this HTML for websites. This one here gives you the full, um, which is the full code for the entire picture and the clickable part that you need. And then you're just going to change the very first address between the colons there and to put your own referral link or wherever you want it to go. Save that, post it into, into back page. Like I showed you there, um, wherever it was, it's gone. <laughs> I think I closed the tab. Not to worry, guys. Um, I think I closed the tab. <clears throat> so and that's what you would do. And it really is as simple as that. Okay, it gives you the um, gives you all the information that you need, and it gives you the images. I almost lost thread what I'm saying. I hope, I hope that makes sense for you. Um, so using Ad Creator, Tiny Pick, and you can also use things like this for Craigslist back page, and I, I do use the images as well for group posting as well. So I hope that makes sense. Trying to keep it under ten minutes. Um, check out the site for more tools and training. I hope it's of use to you. And check out the link below the video, and you can see all about my Perseverance Network, which you saw a picture of just now. And take a look through and we'll, um, see what the system's all about. I hope it's been useful to you guys. Speak to you again soon and thanks for watching. Cheers now.